All right, you want it, you got it. Welcome to the U.S. History Summer School 2019 Overview Tutorial. So, hey, look, let's be straight up honest with it. You're taking U.S. History right now, um, again, because you probably didn't perform the best the first time. So, you know what? We're going to change the way things go for you so that way you can be the most successful person possible and get an awesome grade, learn a lot, and have fun in the summer, too. Because trust me, I get it. It's hot outside. Fun is waiting. So I'm going to work with you. If you work with me, let's get going on this one. So first thing we need to know that we go to McLeodClass.com, and up here everything is there for us. We have Don McLeod. You want to learn something about me, click it. You want to look at our policies, go ahead. Um, but our real tab that we're looking at right now is Summer School, so let's click on Summer School, and notice we're here. Boom. We have the grading percentage broken down for you, so it shows you what things are are what in terms of percentage for your grade so we know where we're going with it so there's no confusion ever uh, we can read about the grading rubric but I'll tell you after what's really cool is our online textbook that we're going to use is already embedded here for you so you simply just left click it and it opens it up to this so you'll notice don't freak out I see the thousand pages and you're like oh my god what did I get myself into no 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 don't worry about that we're gonna go through it what's really cool everything is hyperlinked so we can go straight to it we're good when we need it, but don't freak out on that one. Uh, if you ever need a chat, you can just click this chat, and it sends me, it sends you to a Google form that you can fill out and just talk to me. So if you want to be anonymous about it and you don't want to talk in front of people, just click that. Real easy way to reach me. Uh, if we scroll down though, we're gonna look at our in-depth calendar. So yes, you know it. We got everything planned out for you for the five weeks that we are together. We're gonna get going with this. So if you want to know exactly detailed what we're going through, you'll notice here, so we start on the 17th, uh, the blue is always the unit. So what unit we're on, the gray is going to be the particular focus for the day. Uh, this pinkish light red is the question that we're really focusing on. And again, it's inquiry-based learning, so we want to focus on some big question and answer it and figure like, is it right, is it wrong, what do I think? That's what we're focusing on for the day. Uh, here is the standard for the content that we're looking at and then we start going with it in terms of our stuff and you're asking like oh what order does it go in no problem got you covered so if we scroll down to the bottom here you will see this so you notice it says week one week two week three week four and week five you can simply click on all of them and it'll show you the weeks as we go through what this is this is color coded for us so just like I do in my regular class I color code everything so that we see what we're doing uh, blue is always some type of tutorial, so I'm going to spend a little bit of time helping you with it. Green is maybe a lecture. We're looking at content. We're reading a book a little bit. We're getting some input on our own or with my help assistance, but that's really what green is. It could be a podcast as well, so it doesn't always have to be reading. Uh, it'll be different. I'm going to change it up quite a bit on this one. Anytime you see a yellow, it's a simulation, an activity, uh, a debate. It's some type of collaborative something that we're really working together on, group project, whatever it is. Uh, this pink slash purple is film analysis. So again, film analysis is very different than just sitting there watching videos because I have you do things with the film analysis. Uh, and we'll go over that later. Red is always a break. Always, 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 I believe in giving you breaks because your brain needs it from time to time. You will notice that you'll see Aries checks. So throughout the week, we have Aries checks. So we're going to make sure everything is done there correctly that we need to. Yes, and everything is good. But I want you to go through it, look at it, you know, feel like, oh, cool. I want you to get pumped about it because I don't want you to be upset that you're having to take the course because I promise you're going to learn a ton of stuff and it's just going to be freaking awesome and we're going to have a great time with it. Uh, film analysis tutorial. So I'm going to click this, take us here. This is what we're going to be using for film analysis. So each person's going to have one of these. Well, we'll notice if we go through the directions, yeah, buddy, it's going to tell us about it. We'll get to that later. Um, each time we do a film, we're going to write about it. So you notice there's a text box here. You would click in it and you start writing. Your expectation is I'm going to give you the prompt for the day. You're going to write this whole thing. You're going to fill it up. Okay. We're watching a full film series, so you should do that. Everything you'll notice here, we have it as we go down. We keep going, keep going, keep going. They're all there for us. So the expectation, again, is you fill up this, and this is really going to be a big part of your grade if we go back to it. In terms of film analysis, this is really, really there because I believe in films. I believe in the power of visualization and what it helps us wrestle with and see. So this is a lot of fun. Um, like it says, fill up the entire box. You don't have to take notes, but if you want to make a separate slide on one of these things to take notes while the film is going to help you answer the stuff better, 
no problem. Totally up to you on that one. Uh, so you choose and just go with it. We are going to build a web page. This is how we're going to do things. We are going to actually put things on a web page instead of having a graphic organizer and some notebook like that. We're going to make a full web page so that when you're done with it, you can put it on your resume and you can be awesome. So what we're going to do is we're going to build something like this. So I'll walk you through it each time. I just want you to see what we're doing, that you're going to build your own web page and you're going to add to it over time. Um, that really is it for the most part on that. Shouldn't be that difficult, but notice everything is here for us. I have everything hyperlinked, ready to go, so you're good to go. Just make sure you know that we always go to mccloudclass.com. We click Summer School, and we go through all the stuff. Schedule is always updated for you here. Everything, good to go. And again, when it's a red day, don't show up. So that should be it. If you have any questions ever, just DM me, send me a chat request, text me. But should be pretty easy, so I hope you got a good overview of what to expect this summer. All right, guys, we'll see you.